What up? This is episode 6 on my commentary on the Olympic Winter Games 2014 Sochi. I love the Olympics. There is like the real life Hunger Games without the killing, but I mean it is the history, the competition, the sportsmanship, the the performance, the athletes, the the grandeur, the everything, the motivation, the passion, the dedication that is compiled into these games every four years, whether it's winter games or summer games, and I just love it. I, I eat it. It's about the spirit of the games, the competition, um, celebrating athletes around the world at their best, being at their best, and it is just so epic just to witness that and you know and the, again the history that goes with how many games there's been and going back to a tradition of an era uh, of the ancient Greeks into the modern times and the second part I think that what makes the Olympics so epic for me is is the the performance how much emotion there is and how much um, anticipation there is watching the performance and for the athletes themselves but it is that performance watching that that perfect race or that that perfect stick that that perfect shot that that perfect dive it's just you you want to see these people at their best and you just want to watch this competition well, to me, I, I watch this competition looking at, about these people, athletes, who put their best on the line, who train to for this moment, and it's just, it's just so crazy, so crazy. And again, the emotion that goes behind it, like, yo, yo, like. So the Olympics is nothing without the athletes and of course you're going to look out for the star athletes and last winter to me it was like Apollo Ono and J.R. Selsky and I got to talk about J.R. Selsky because like yo, um, homeboy is half Filipino from California, uh, raised west coast pretty much Washington state and California and come from a military family, yo. That's tight. I think this video um, NBC put out about a promo towards the Sochi is really great and it, and it features J.R. Selsky and pretty much it entails everything that I think is great about the Olympics um, and how he is using Macklemore's song 10,000 Hours and reminding himself to put the best forward, to be the best. And that's what the Olympics is, you know? You want to be the best. And that's why I draw a lot of inspiration from the Olympics because here's people who are perfecting their craft. And it's just like, it, yo, you just need to remind yourself in your own life, like, yo, you need to build up yourself. You need to level up. You need to be the best. You need to be, you need to go for the gold every day be great in gold and so yo 10,000 hours that's something that I can take with me and I, I want everyone to be like yo that's something that is yo <laughs> but like wasted 10,000 10,000 hours well, I